today i want to talk about something that's often underestimated and not many people talk about that it is the incredible power of changing your mind as a crucial part of your personal evolution now changing your mind is a fascinating journey and i can tell that from my personal experience of changing my own mind on so many things over the years both in investing and outside of it you see we live in a world that's constantly evolving and so should we changing your mind is not a sign of weakness but a testament to your growth and adaptability it's the capacity to question your beliefs and opinions to be open to new ideas and to evolve into a better version of yourself over time let me talk about investing there have been so many things that i have changed my mind on when it comes to investing my own money it has not been a 180 degree change instead it has been a gradual and subtle change in some of the most important ideas in investing for example when i was working as an analyst and early in my investment career i believed the biggest risk to investing was stock prices jumping up and down however over time i have come to appreciate more of what warren buffett or how warren buffett defines risk which is permanent loss of capital also risk to me now means not just losing money permanently by investing in bad businesses but also missing out on opportunities by not investing in good businesses when i should be or for that matter not been able to meet my financial goals because of the two risks i just mentioned another thing i have changed my mind over these years is the equation of luck versus skill in investing i am now highly aware of the role of luck in whatever i achieve as an investor of course i also understand that skill shines through in the long run and when i am able to stay with my process across market cycles but i have no doubt that luck plays a huge huge role not just in the short term but also in the long term another perspective that has evolved for me over time is the role of emotions in investing very early in my career i believed that successful investing was purely a rational and analytical endeavor so i aimed to make decisions based solely on data logic and sound financial principles and i often downplayed the role of emotions in the process but as i have gained experience i have come to understand that emotions are an inherent part of investing emotions like fear and greed can influence decisions and impact investment outcomes but rather than trying to eliminate emotions entirely i have learned to acknowledge and manage them effectively i still fail at a lot in managing my emotions effectively but i am just trying to get better so my idea of dealing with emotions involves developing the ability to stay disciplined during market turbulence resisting impulsive actions during euphoric periods and maintaining a really long term perspective another evolving perspective in my approach to investing pertains to financial goals and values in the early stages of my investment journey i focused primarily on maximizing financial returns often at the expense of other personal values or life goals the sole objective was to accumulate a lot of wealth but as i have matured as an investor or i think i have i have recognized the importance of aligning my investments with my broader life goals and values it's not just about the returns on investment but also the returns on life i've learned that a successful investment portfolio is one that not only grows wealth but also enhances my overall well-being and fulfills my values and aspirations this perspective on investing has enriched my financial journey and it has provided me a sense of purpose and fulfillment which is beyond the pursuit of financial returns so overall these are the ideas from investing i've changed my mind on over the last few years and every time i've done that it has been an opportunity for me to learn and grow and as i realize now i have gained new insights and knowledge when you change your mind on things that require such a change it's a sign that you are not trapped in your own convictions but you are willing to evolve based on your experiences changing your mind in fact can be liberating it allows you to explore new horizons and see the world from different angles it's like unlocking a door to a room you never knew existed it broadens your understanding and enriches your life with this thanks for joining me today and as always stay tuned for more conversations like this where i try to keep things real and relatable until next time happy investing